Ah, Some, the 23rd in a series of songs and explanation by Dave Mormon. When Dave retired, he and Sherry intended to find a place on the Front Range, Denver, so they just moved in with Matt in Burlington. Three adults with one bathroom was rather crowded, and the rent was high. Worse, they discovered that housing prices in the city were skyrocketing. But now they could travel, and they made many trips to Albuquerque to see Mildred. Dave had a lot of time to pursue his hobbies. However, his elderly laptop could not render videos very easily. So he got the latest version of Muse Score, the music processor, and began writing songs. He would get an idea, a snippet of melody or an interesting chord progression, and work it up into a fair bit of orchestration. For years, he had improvised on the piano, but unless he memorized the piece, it just disappeared into the atmosphere. They celebrated Christmas with Jane and Mildred, and in June, they were there for her 92nd birthday. But in July, she had a bad fall and wound up flat on her back. Her body atrophied, and on August 11, 2017, she passed away. Sherry, Jane, and Dave wondered what scripture to use for her eulogy. At a Chinese restaurant, they got three fortunes from the cookies, and these worked perfectly for summing up mom's long life. In December, 2017, Jane, Matt, Sherry, and Dave went to Dana Point, California, to whale watch. The whales were on Christmas vacation, but they were overwhelmed by a hundred dolphins. They also went to Mission San Juan Capistrano and several art galleries. They inherited Mildred's farmland and decided to form an LLC. So, their trip to California was also their first corporate board meeting. Matt really needed a better place to reside. They found a little two-bedroom house in Burlington that had a mother-in-law's cottage in the backyard. This one-bedroom cabin was perfect for Dave and Sherry. They bought the whole place cash, and figured they could use what would be the monthly house payments to travel. And did they ever travel? They even stopped at places along the way, just for fun. Sherry and Dave both had their 50th class reunions in 2018. Sherry's class in Montgomery City met in August, at the hottest, muggiest time in Missouri. They also had a chance to visit with many of her cousins. Dave's reunion was in September during homecoming at Hickman High School, Columbia, Missouri, home of the Cupies. Dave was tempted to return to the pulpit, as had many of his colleagues who flunked retirement. But the chance to travel was too important. Even a little church would have tied down their weekends. As they settled in at Burlington, they began to attend the United Methodist Church, which was just across the street, and found a new church family, one that Dave did not have to professionally shepherd. Now it was time to return to video editing. With his Galaxy 10 smartphone as the best movie camera he ever owned, and video studio on his new desktop computer, Dave was able to take videos from their trips and put them over as music. These were published on YouTube, with a whopping 28 subscribers. Dave has also pulled up some of his sermons from YouTube and spiffied them up, at one and a quarter speed, and slides, rather than just show his face. Dave's calling into the ordained ministry never provided a lot of money. Then again, his calling was not towards wealth. His reason for life was in sharing ideas, care, and love with people. And because it was fairly steady work, with retirement built into the package, he developed a nice income for the rest of his life. Now he can continue to share ideas, care, and love. He is in awe, at the resulting sum, of his life. Thanks for listening. Be sure to click like, and subscribe to hear more of Dave's life in music.